man suspected of slashing thousands of tires over the past 16 years here in Austin is finally facing serious charges. Now here's the suspect, 56-year-old Tommy Kelly. After doing some digging, we found that Kelly has a rap sheet dating back to 1973. He's had more than 500 run-ins with Austin police and been arrested 57 times. Over the past 16 years, police say Kelly has harassed one Austin neighborhood in particular, Hyde Park, using makeshift metal tools to slash hundreds of tires. He's even been caught in the act a couple of times before, but those misdemeanor charges never stopped him. KXA's Chris Sadegi live in Hyde Park with a reaction from neighbors. Well, these are the charges against Kelly. It is a thick stack, and the numbers inside of it simply staggering. Hundreds, maybe even thousands of cases where Kelly is suspected of doing this, slashing tires. Now, all along, Kelly has been suspected of doing this, but in the past, the evidence was never enough for serious prison time. This could change that. Each time Carla Fowl needed to go somewhere, she held her breath. I could never rely on having my car. In 2010, she was left feeling deflated many a time. Last year was four times. So frequent, it's become a cost of living in Hyde Park and a high one. For me alone last year, it was more than $2,000. And since 1994, police and neighbors have long suspected the Hyde Park tire slasher to be Tommy Joe Kelly, a homeless man often seen in the area. But there was always one problem. Without an eyewitness or affirmative link, we weren't able to charge him in the past. That's why Corolla and others invested in cameras, but Detective Eric Hodusky, who was assigned to the case last month, found a new way to stop the slashing. I discovered four specific cases in which Mr. Kelly was either in possession of, found to be using, or found to be manufacturing a special metal tool. From 400 suspected cases in just the past four years, Hodusky focused on four specific cases where Kelly was found with these weapons, and rather than a misdemeanor charge that would keep him in jail for a matter of weeks, possessing a criminal instrument is a felony that carries prison time. Does it mean cars in Hyde Park are safe? Seemed almost too much for one person to be able to do it. Residents had established their own website to track the slashings and were about to spend $10,000 on infrared cameras. If putting Kelly in prison is a cure-all, that remains to be seen. It's a lovely place to live, and that was a serious fly in the ointment. And Kelly is facing four felony charges, each one punishable between two and ten years in prison if convicted. We're live in Hyde Park. Chris Sadegi, KXAN, Austin News.